terrorism case against two Atlanta men may be bigger than we thought. The men accused of planning attacks from a New Mexico compound are also named in a federal search warrant as having a second facility, this one in Alabama. The Alabama property is registered to Siraj Wahaj, one of the two men charged in the New Mexico case. Authorities say the Alabama compound had a military-style obstacle course. Wahaj and four other adults are also charged with kidnapping a Metro Atlanta boy whose remains were found at the New Mexico location. Newton County parents on trial accused of killing their baby. Christopher McNabb and Courtney Bell are charged with murdering little Kalia by hitting her in the head. The Covington News reports tonight a jury is seated. Opening statements start tomorrow. Governor Kemp is only hours away from signing the most controversial bill of his brief tenure. The so-called heartbeat bill would outlaw most abortions once a doctor detects a fetal heartbeat. Opponents are lining up to sue once it's signed. Kemp's 2018 opponent, Stacey Abrams, tweeted it's a political stunt and voters will fight back. One sign, it takes effect January 1st. Tiger Woods has another award, the Presidential Medal of Freedom. President Trump honored the Masters champion this evening. The two have golfed together at the President's Club in Florida. Trump called Woods a true legend.